You seriously want to body paint your leg? Pink? I'm just thinking, you know. You know what I don't like about it? It's not really pink. I know it's pink, but it's not a pink that I feel pink in. Suzanne Mars, ladies! So forward. She would like travel around the world with her troop of club kids, DJs, and throw parties and get paid for it. I'm drawn to people that make statements with their looks. You can be like that, but no swimming. Suzanne Varsh was the one who championed me and said, you have got a future, you are something special. More than any other time in my life, that's when I needed to hear that. Suzanne Varsh has been dubbed New York's queen of the night. Her occupation? Well, she puts on parties, but they're more like full-scale theatrical assaults. She encourages people to say, what are you? Express it. What are you today? Express that. Where's the line? <laughs> I don't think Suzanne ever anticipated being like a wife, being a mother. When Suzanne gets dressed up, she's not my mother, really. She's sort of a character that she plays. You know, I didn't want a broken family because, you know, in the end, my family was broken too, and that was the basic thing I didn't think I would repeat. The beginning of the AIDS epidemic as it kept mounting was a horrifying sci-fi movie. What can I do? And I'm going, why don't I fight this thing and do something about it? Stars are coming out tonight for a big benefit to raise money to fight AIDS. But this is not your run-of-the-mill charity event. I mean, we raised millions. When Suzanne Barsh took the stage, it, it really was an electric feeling in the room. Suzanne, she played a lot of roles of me accepting myself. I needed that. I needed it. Big day, I feel like you're getting married. <laughs> Living life is hard. You know, we have to go through all sorts of ups and downs in life, and to get through it in a positive way isn't always easy. If it's not a statement, what's the point?